Hi guys, in today's tutorial I will show you how to apply any effect or a preset in two simple clicks, let's begin. To make that happen, you will need a free plugin called FX Console. Check this video's description, I will leave a download link there. Once you installed it on your PC or Mac, open up your AE and press Ctrl plus space to open FX Console and here we can type any effects and presets names and find them easy. But what if I tell you that you can do it even faster without writing effects or presets names, let me show you how. Under FX, here you can see a number 1, under that number 1, I have saved a preset that I use every single time when I edit my videos, so if I now press 1 on my keyboard, or simply click on that number 1, preset will be applied in seconds. And now let me show you how to save any preset and create easy shortcuts. But first I will create an adjustment layer so I can apply effects on it, you can apply on a videos as well, doesn't matter where you will apply. And now let me show you why you should use FX console, for example on that adjustment layer I want to apply one of my presets. So let's go to effects and presets, then animation presets, then user presets, then AM film transitions, then the folder I need, and finally I'm here. Doesn't matter what effect or a preset you are looking for, it will take so long, or even typing and searching, it's not that comfortable as using FX console. So now let me show you how to save all the presets that you are using almost every time and make your workflow faster than before. Let's press Ctrl plus space and click on that gear icon here. Under a shortcuts here you can add any presets and a label. Let's click on new here and then search for a preset you want to add. I will add one from my transitions pack. Once you found the preset or an effect you want to add, click on that preset and then under a label, you can choose any keyboard shortcuts, I will make it under a number 2 and then hit OK. Let's click OK here as well and check if it works. Make sure that the layer is selected and then press Ctrl plus space to open FX console. Now I will press 2 and see if the preset will be applied. And that's it. Now you can go to FX console and add more of your favorite presets. That thing is really helpful. I have added the shakes from my pack, transitions, and other effects I use all the time and it really makes everything easier. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.